Welcome back to State Champs. Let's go back to our Metro PCS High School highlights, the Division I Boys Track and Field Finals. We begin with the 3200 run. Lakeland senior Jared Zook, the individual cross country state champ in the fall, fifth in this event a year ago. A 4.22 GPA salutatorian of his class, first in the two mile in 2012. Garrett will lace him up for Michigan State next year. To the field events, another guy who will be competing for Michigan State except in basketball, the reigning Mr. Basketball in the state of Michigan, Bay City Western's Matt Costello. Apparently he's got a good arm too. Here in the discus, the senior's best throw on the day, 178 feet, Costello took gold to the shot put. Swartz Creek sophomore Kevin Weiler had one of the most dominant seasons in Genesee County history. He broke the school record, the county record, and at the state meet, 55 feet 10 inches, Kevin became only the second sophomore in 80 years in Division I to win the shot put. To the long jump we go. Celine school record holder senior Steven Bastion won regionals. His best jump on this day, 23 feet 5 inches. Steven wins and was second on the pole ball. Back to the races, 110 hurdles. Ann Arbor Pioneer senior Drake Johnson looking to win his third straight state title. The Michigan football recruit who is dealing with a hamstring injury, hail to the victors. Drake finishes his senior year undefeated in the 110 hurdles, third goal. To the 100 meter dash, middle of your screen, Ypsilanti's Austin Sanders finished second at last year's state meet. He put in the work so this year he would be number one. Here, edging out West Bloomfield's Jeff Ari Guzzo. Sanders took third in the 200 a year ago, but here, even though he slipped out of the blocks, able to turn on the Jets. And again, it's Ari Guzzo who will have to settle for second place. Sanders finished All-State in four events on the day. The Ypsilanti boys as a team finished ninth. Milford was your 2011 Division I cross country state champs looking to add a track title to the trophy case. 3200 relay, tight battle in the early going between the Mavericks and their KLAA rivals Brighton. But Milford pulled away in the final leg. Senior Brandon Wallace anchors a triumph. Feels great. Uh, the other three runners we had ran fast, you know, put me in a good position. I just had to finish off. Let's go to the 800 meter run. It was close between Wallace and Scott Bradley of Battle Creek Lakeview, but Wallace wins the state title. Next to the mile, Milford's Brian Kettle ran a 416 of regionals, came in the number one seed. The sophomore wouldn't disappoint at states either. He wins 1600 gold. Milford ends the day in four. Graham Blank had the program's best season ever, undefeated season in the very competitive KLAA, third straight regional title, broke five school records in 2012. 800 relay, good finish between Jalen Curitan and Lake Orient's Nick Malovich. In the end, the senior Curitan with the kick for the win. Last race on the afternoon, 1600 meter relay, Lake Orient. Recent Oakland County champs needed a place in the top three to capture its first track and field title. Lake Orion and Groves in the final stretch, and it's Lake Orion senior Nick Malovich by a fraction of a second, first across the finish line. The Dragons did it. Lake Orion scored in sprints, hurdles, distances, and relays. Added up, the boys grabbed their first track and field state championship in school history. Oh, it's awesome. The first time in school history and first time for our coach who's been here for like forever and it's so surreal that we won this and just a lot of nobody from Lake Orion. The high school highlights are presented by Metro PCS. Wireless for all!